Right then, guys and girls, here we go. Little cracker look. 1965 Sunbeam Rapier look. 17,000 miles only. Last owner, 45 years. Blimey, look at that. And it just goes to show, look, doesn't it? Look how lovely she is. Very, very nice. I'll just show you, uh, show you around it quickly and just show you what's what. But she's absolutely lovely. Where are you going to find another one of these? Look at that. Obviously, check it all out for yourself. But look at that. Lovely wood, nice steering wheel, lovely dash. Carpets and things, only criticism if you're being really picky, just a quick wet wet vac and uh, get a bit of colour back into them. But um, overall, you can't really knock it. Look, she's absolutely lovely in there. I'll just fire her up. What have we got on there? 17961. Showing on the old clock. There we go. Just pop that choke in a little bit. Good oil pressure straight away there. Look, creeping up, as you can see. Ticking over there, lovely. Nice wheels, very very good on the uh, on the bodywork and paintwork and such like. Chrome as well. Look, lovely bumpers. Yeah, look at that under there. One. Well, a little sweetie. You better pop down and have a look, guys. She's lovely. Look, I haven't been right underneath it yet. Looks very good. Yeah, it does look very good. There's a few ever, ever so minor bits just creeping through down there, but nothing you'd rush out and do. But at the same time, don't leave it too late. You want to catch it quickly. Rear chrome. Just ever so slightly started pitting a little bit. Got nice plates there in the back. Nice and tidy in the boot. Bit of the tool kit and spare, spare wheel in there. Which has been on as you can see. Very good under the boot lid. But I'll tell you what, what a lovely car. Do you know much about this, Uncle Paul? Sadly not, they don't, but no, I mean, uh, that regular transport of guy brought it. It looks ever so clean, doesn't it? Doesn't it just? But no, I, I haven't been out in it, I'm afraid. No. Well, there you go, guys. Obviously, uh, the next step now is to pop down and have a look, see what you think. That's the best thing to do. Just touch base with the girls in the office with regards to a bit of paperwork. They can let you know what we've got for it when you come down. Just flick it off a minute. There you go. But uh, no, I certainly suggest you come down and have a look. I don't think you'll be disappointed with it, that's for sure. No, lovely car. There you go.